everyone welcome back to our channel today we have a thrift haul thank you so much for clicking that button and watching our video I just kissed Tilda and I have her hair mom's dog life anyhow so, the, um, Salvation Army has a new thing today. I was off because, like, I have a, an appointment, but I needed to uh, pick me up. So, here we are. Anyways, let me um, tell you about the latest thing about Salvation Army. So, Salvation Army now um, has, like, uh, five for five, which they had before, but only on clothes. So, whatever the tag is... If that's a tag and you get five, it's five dollars. So they're a dollar each. So now they included everything on it minus the furniture and the um, shoes. So this is the second week that I actually took advantage of it. Um, the ones that I used for last week, I guess I've already, I don't, I've been using it and, um, already. So. Let me show you. So I went to three Salvation Armies, my regular Salvation Army, and then the one close to it, which is downtown Detroit on 4th Street, and then Verner, um, Verner Highway, and then in Detroit also, Southwest Detroit, and then I had to pick up something, so I went over to the Livonia one. So let me show you what we have, and everything is a dollar except for um, maybe three items. So I brought my own packing stuff. So let me show you this. So this one is from the um, one by Livonia. So um, this is a nice pottery vase that is thin and um it was white tag so everything that is white tag is a dollar or five for five they were 14.99 and this is artist sign the artist is right there and it is from a shop like a furniture shop called art van this is by john bergen bergen studio so they were 50 60 dollars so yeah i love the color and um it just looks nice on its own. I don't know if I'm going to put flowers on it because that's too much flowers. But yeah, I snagged that baby up and I'm going to put it right here or maybe just like that because there are dogs in here. The second one, they didn't wrap this for me. I wrapped this myself and I brought my own paper because that's just the thing now when you go to the shop. It's like you just have to use it your own, not unless you have like... A different shop so I got this one this is not marked but I like the colors and somebody actually drilled a hole in it so this will be an awesome planter and you can see that there's a chip so they wanted $3.99 but I got it for a dollar and then oops, the next one so I got this beautiful bowl right here pottery bowl they were $9.99 but it's white tag and that is the artist signature I just love that um that thing and it looks like I have like a Evans like two Evans um pottery piece from Scotland it looks like that but I don't think that that is an Evans uh signature so and then another pottery is this nice this one is a lot more heavier this is like a little lighter than this so um this is also 9.99 i like the boho print on it and then the artist signature is right there and i don't know what it is so it's white tag and it's a dollar and if you notice it's not a perfect round shape it has like an odd shape which i like it could be a catch-me-all kind of like thing, but I don't know yet what I'm going to do with that. So I'll put that on the side um, and get my paper and put it back in here. So when I fit again, 
it is very chaotic in like my dollars i mean my thrift store it's like super chaos like I, I i don't know if i like that so but i know why it's chaos because it's a dollar um this one i also got so all of those are like in livonia so i also got this one it, it is for a hat pin um i uh, this is my fourth one maybe but i have i wanted to organize my hat pins in there and these were four dollars so i picked that up so that's that and then on the linens i got this like cover for your bed and i'm hoping that it fits our bed and this was i don't i don't know if this is actually like something that was um made handmade or purchased but they are 10.99 originally but today they are a dollar i don't see any tags on it oh yeah there is a tag so yeah it's like pills pilser brothers bronx new york so that's the tag so um it doesn't tell me the size though federal requirement blah 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 license blah 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 but um i was thinking about like um putting this as a cover because i have big hairy dogs and so my whole house is a hair plus my hair because i have long hair now um but yeah that's what i do with these things because that way when we I, this is the print Ugh. i don't know if you guys can see that one so i don't i don't really care about the print so much i mean i don't dislike it i don't love it it's just one of those things that i need so for a dollar that's a good thing so gotta wash that so we can use them already and then in this bag so i can get my 10 for 10 i have this like banana republic extra small um like skirt so that's cool i will wear that and this is 8.99 if they were not the dollar thing but it is a dollar and then this is also regular price i just like it so i got this ralph lauren i like the the um color of it and it is rlx so maybe it's like their um like athletic wear or something along that line they were size two they were eight ninety nine nine dollars but i like the color so and then it has like a little shorts right here so i thought that would be perfect for rocking which is a sport that i do with my husband i don't know if you can call it a sport but it's every sunday we do that and then i have this like lulu lola row i don't even know what that is it was 2.99 and it was this nice skirt i like the colors so that was part of the five for five so i got the other ones and then that and then part of the livonia one too this is the first one that i saw is this lamp right here how gorgeous is that vintage lamp so i didn't check because i got so excited but the finial is like weird see how like it's like that so i have to get something to hold it and it's one of those clippy kind of things so they wanted 19 20 dollars for this originally but i got it for a dollar today so i love that i might use that for our bedroom but i don't know yet because we really need like badly a side table they do have some staining right here so i'm not sure if i'm able to like clean that and how to go by cleaning it so let me know in the comments down below if you have an idea so the next one is behind me right over here this big wall art and i'm gonna show you it's a little heavy oops i needed help to actually get this Ooh, did i make okay so it is like this kind of art right here which is i love that one over there 
was also from Salvation Army. It's like a paper art. So this one was $30, but I got it for a dollar. How cool is that? And that's the signature right there. So I'm um, thinking I'm putting it in the bedroom, but I don't know yet. I'm pretty sure that my husband would hate it. Everything that I like, he doesn't like. We don't have the same type of like um, when it comes to like stuff for the house, but it's okay. And then also a dollar is this massive lamp right here. And they wanted $19 for it right there. But I got it today for a dollar. And then um, it doesn't have any markings. But it's super awesome. The lady, when I was checking out, said that it matches the wall art. So, yeah. I was thinking about putting in the bedroom too because my husband knocks the small things, like the small lamps, like the first one. But I needed an actual table to do that. So, anyways, um, those are all from like the... Livonia one. So those are like one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, and I'm missing one. Oh, ten. The blankie. So yeah. And then on my local um, Salvation Army, this is the one that I was hoping to get. I got it. So this is like a Chinese pot, but I like like the fig figural stuff. I thought that's a lion, or at least I think I wanted it to be a lion. And then there's like a fleur de lis, and then another lion, and then another fleur de lis. This does not match any of my outdoor pots, but being it has a lion, you all know Detroit Lions. So this they wanted $35, but today I snag it for a dollar. It is not a very heavy pot doesn't look like it's used and that's the bottom and again it's made in China I don't know what the markings is on this one but definitely excited to um, use that for outdoors for my plants and then actually we're gonna go here because this is the one basically that is from Fort Street and I'll show you so there are some items there that I saw that I couldn't leave behind because I want to make sure I have it for my collection. So um, first is this one right here. I'll show you guys. And I'm very happy to have this in my collection. It's a two thing so let me find the bottom that way you guys can see what I was talking about uh, yeah this is the one so I have um, several ones of these so this is the bottom and what it is though it is this beautiful blue sky um, candle holder and it is a Santa Claus. Super nice. Um, no chips, no crack. Um, how much did I pay for this one? I think I paid $5 for it. Yeah. So, they didn't know what it was, clearly. That's the thing, though. Um, sometimes they do know, sometimes they don't. And you can see the markings where it says Blue Sky. And then Heather Goldman right there. So... This is awesome. So, um, super intricate. I like the spaghetti stuff right there. So, yeah. And I'm going to put this here because I don't want to ruin this thing. It's too intricate. So, that might probably be in my um, home decor. Or my Christmas thing. I don't know yet. Or maybe I can put it on my eBay shop or my knickknack shop that I am going to be building soon. But I'll let you guys know. The next one for a dollar at the 4th Street Salvation Army. This is the one that I got so anxious because people are just everywhere and annoying. 
So I got this Jeanette um, compote or bowl right here or dish. They wanted $15, but today I got it for a dollar. I think it's moon and stars, maybe. I'm not sure. But, yep, I got that. And then also part of the dollar thing that I'm going to wear tonight because we're having my husband's dinner. It even has a tag on. It's by Sara. It's this beautiful dress right here. And it's my size. It is um, extra small. So, y'all. They wanted $13 for it. But today, because it's white tag, I got it for a dollar. It has shoulder pads. I'm not sure about shoulder pads. But whatever. Alright, next we have... There's this set right here. So, I'm going to pause you guys so I can show you the set. Hold on. Okay, so they said eight, but it's not really eight. And let me show you. So I have this beautiful set right here. So it comes with a chocolate or coffee pot. And the markings on here is like SR Ridgeway. Ironstone established in 1992. Staffordshire, England. All colors guaranteed on their glazed and detergent proof English garden so that is that so I have this and then this one is that and why do I say that it's like a coffee or a um, chocolate pot more than likely coffee is because when you look inside there's still coffee no that's not the indication the spout right there where um, it pours the coffee well this is the spot well the opening of the spot spout it doesn't have any um, cover like um, like a grid. Usually when you have like a teapot, it does have that. The chocolate and the coffee pot does not have that. Why do I know? I don't know. I just assume because like I have several ones. So I have the pot and then I have the butter dish that goes with it. Super nice. It makes me want to have like a... Um, uh, tea party they were $20 for the set but they I got the whole set for a dollar that's how awesome this deal is that's why people are going goo goo gaga I got the creamer right here and I pre-selected this last Monday when I went there with my husband there you go and then that's the bottom and then this is the sugar and it still has the sugar I really have to clean that but it's okay it's all good that's awesome um and then they want i got this like glass um little boss right here they wanted ten dollars for this thing it's like probably chinese because it doesn't have any markings but i do like these um for like putting flowers so i'm gonna do that and then I got, hi baby, um, I gotta find the other one, they are so um, crazy on that, that place, I, ugh, I'm telling you, I was so overwhelmed, I can't find the other one now, um, okay, so I'm going to move right here, and then you right here oh it's right here so i collected these ones like the uh, travel mug these are by gans these ladies right here these are salt and pepper shakers so they were 14 dollars, but they were a dollar a pair today so i don't know which one's the salt and which one is pepper and they're by susan polly right there i think it's polly is it polly yeah so that would be cute. That's definitely going to go to my shop. And then I got this Westmoreland and it's tag right there. Little bud vase. This is my third one. I have two upstairs um, on my collection. And I just love these bud vase. So swung, mini swung vase, I could say. Um, $10, they wanted it. But today it is a dollar. All right. 
So, I stock up on these vintage planters. You all know me. Excuse me, planters. I got this one right here. Super cute. Um, it doesn't have any markings, but I, I love it. So, that'd be cute with a little plant. And then I even got this, even though they have tons of crazy. So, but again, I like the color. And it doesn't, again, have any markings. This one, they wanted $9 for this planter. So, I got those for a dollar each. And then, for the dollar again... I got this plate right here, super gorgeous. I got this like mini planter. It has a little nick right over there, but nobody can see it. And this is by Wedgwood, England, right there. And they wanted $13 for this one, but today I got it for a dollar. This would be cute for like um, tea time or something. I would really want to use that. And then I got this for a regular price just because I think I'm cute enough to wear this. <laughs> but we're going to have to figure this one out. Okay, this is by Derek Lamb. So whoever Derek Lamb is, this is, I paid $6 for this. Cool, right? So like I said, I thought I was like young and thick enough thin enough to <laughs> wear that but whatever and then I went over to the Vernier one and let me show you not too many stuff in there for the 10 for 10 but I got some amazing stuff like an amazing find in there I got this vase right over here um it is marked T something this is going to be cute for my cut flower garden for next year. And then I got this purse that I will be pairing with the dress that I got. I thought that was cute for dinner. And then this was $5.99 but a dollar today. It's just a regular thing. I just I just love these like, like kind of um, purse um, during the summer. So, yep. And then, I got this one as well. This is just like a planter. Because I have to get five. Well, I don't. But this has like a giant hole right there. So, I'm excited to put something in there for my planter thing. That's not going to work. So, um, I also got this one. I got the white version of this one, so now I think I wanted to collect these. These are $7 originally, but they were a dollar today. So, and then this is regular price, but I just thought I like these. These are going to be comfortable to wear. It doesn't have any size, so I'm thinking I'm going to look like Ronald McDonald and this is going to be like too loose for me. Oh, well. So, it's like a little jumper and it's $7. And they have pockets right here. The material, though, is like super nice linen. So that's why I grabbed that. And then this is the score find that I thought I had today. So I have this hand-decorated candle carolers. So they are candle holder in the original box. And they were a dollar. They were adorable. And the fact that they are in the original box is awesome. So, this is the boy right here. So, it's resin. And it has, it's by Star, hand-painted in Japan, right there. So, you put your candle in there. Isn't that adorable? And then the girl is, it even comes with a leaf, is right here. She is adorable. They are adorable look super nice and that's the marking right there um i don't know if they actually um use this but yeah i might put this in knickknacks so um comment down below if you would like to purchase those and then i also found these teak um 
candle holder right here. There's two of them. They're just a block. So they wanted $3.99 for this one, but today the pair is a dollar. So, and this is the first two ones that I actually, oops, grabbed. So they have this like nice um, pink. It doesn't look like it's pink, but it is pink with like um, embossed right there plates. These are $8. They have some wear to them, but... I thought that would be a cute platter for tea time. So, definitely going to put that in my shop. And then this one was $10. So, I do not know what it is. I'm going to have to Google it. But the intricate detail on the, like, the handle are really nice. So, yeah. So, that's part of my 10 for 10. And then... Is that it? Oh, yeah. This is part of my 10 for 10 too. So, I have been eyeing this compote for like several months now. So, now I got it for a way cheaper price. It's that green compote right here. It's uh, pressed glass because you can see like that thing right there. And it's just a nice dish. They wanted $14 for this one. But today, a dollar. So, yeah. And then, part of the linen thing, these two quilted pillow shams by, I don't know, Parking Handcrafts. That's what it says. Uh, Mateo San Francisco, made in China. So, it is this big... Um, pillowcase right here I like it so they were a dollar for the pair so yeah and that is it you guys comment down below which ones are your favorite for me I well this one because this is the score right here I even called my husband honey I got the pot that I like he didn't care because um we have so much stuff in the house but that's okay um I think my favorite is the lamp this lamp and oh god and also the wall art so yeah thank you guys for watching and i'll see you guys soon bye